Well, Cleveland man is gracing the cover of Cosmopolitan magazine as the nation's hottest bachelor. So what's it like to be in Cosmo? There's only one man around here who knows. News Channel 5's Curtis Jackson has the inside story. Oh, 30-year-old Ryan McLean, a chef for two area restaurants, is the nation's most eligible bachelor. Now, few men can say they've graced the pages of Cosmo, let alone the cover. But as it turns out, Ryan and I have a little something in common. We were both Cosmo bachelors. All right, Ryan voted the nation's hottest bachelor this week in New York. He was selected to represent Ohio after a college friend entered him in the contest. Then from among 51 men representing each state and the District of Columbia, he was named the most eligible bachelor and chosen for this month's cover. All I honestly remember hearing is Ohio. And, and I, just, I just stood there. I didn't, I didn't do anything because it wasn't, it was so surreal. A bunch of the guys that were around me started jumping up and down and hugging me and going crazy. And, and they were like, he won. And now, I know a little bit about Ryan's experience. 14 years ago now, I was chosen to represent my home state of Kentucky. Here we go. In the premier bachelor issue. <laughs> A fact I now wish I had kept to myself. <laughs> Words cannot describe the ribbing, as you can hear, that I have taken and will probably continue to take from my colleagues about this picture. All I can tell you folks is that the mustache was cool back in the day. <laughs> a lot of fun. <laughs> and very flattering. You can't get a lot of correspondence <laughs> from people around the world as I did, and I'm sure Ryan's going to get a whole lot more than I ever got. Congratulations to him. In addition to gracing the cover, Ryan won $15,000 in cash and prizes. Let's hope your colleagues are more merciful than mine in a few years. When this all comes back to haunt you, you can read more about my Cosmo experience on our website, newsnet5.com. John? Dude, you got to admit that mustache screams for comments. <laughs>